Hey, what's up, traders? Long time no see, and as a lot of you know, I've been in the process of writing a book, so that's why you haven't seen me too much. Uh, and now the book is finished, so I just want to make a short video talking about it a little bit, and then you can decide if you want to go check it out or not. And you might be wondering, why are these letters blue? Well, why are letters normally blue on this channel? It's because it is a trading psychology book. Um, now, why did I decide to go that route? Well, this might be the only book I ever write. So if that's going to be the case, I want it to be as impactful as humanly possible. And as we have been saying on this channel for the last eight months or so, trading psychology is the number one aspect of Forex trading. And I will likely be keeping this at the very top of that list forever. So as people who watch this channel know, these are the three main pillars of Forex trading. Uh, you don't see fundamental analysis, you don't see sentiment on here because we really don't use that and it's pretty great. But the these are the three you have to concentrate on and in terms of importance you guys might remember I always had trading psychology and money management 1 and 1A. You could interchange them if you wanted to and for a while, at least in the early days, I had money management on top. Um, ever since early 2020, maybe before that, I'd put trading psychology on top um, because I pretty much changed my mind. I saw how trading psychology was affecting a lot of you um, in a very negative way in many cases and also in a very positive way when it came to people who watched the trading psychology videos on the channel, when it came to people who had become um, funded by another company, you know, they pointed to trading psychology as the number one reason why that whole change occurred. So I'm like, well, it's let's be honest, it's probably the number one aspect. And I believe that more now today than I ever have, because look, you know, we create a, a revolutionary technical analysis system on this channel um, that works, that you can test, that gives you clear definitive signals. In my opinion, it is superior to anything else out there right now. So you might have that, and then you might have really great money management. The money management we uh, show on here is very simple. It's adjustable. You can plug it right in. It makes sense. Um, so with these two things, why would, uh, how come everybody's not out there making a ton of money? Well, it's all because of trading psychology. It's the one thing we all think we have and we all think we're very strong at, but we could not be more wrong. We're all egomaniacs in the Forex trading game. It's just one of those things you almost have to have to become a Forex trader. And I can say for me, you know, I had these things early on, but I didn't have this and it took me being completely honest with myself and sitting down and saying, okay, you are not as emotionally strong as you think you are, especially when it comes down to placing your trades and maintaining the trades you have. You're constantly getting in your own way and this is exactly why your account is not going anywhere. Um, so once I really took a step back and started writing down every little issue I was having, every little dilemma I would come across and how I chose to handle it compared to how I should have handled it, it took me doing that for about a year before I really started to come around on my trading psychology and therefore started coming around on my account. Uh, it was break even at best until my trading psychology finally started to come around. And then once it did, it was nothing but up from there. Um, so I can say firsthand and even third hand from watching you guys, trading psychology is number one. Because look, if you don't have this right, this nor this is going to work properly. What good is having these two things at a very high level if they don't work? <laughs> this is the engine that makes it all go. Um, so I thought I would make a book that shared my experiences and what I had seen from watching you guys on this channel and turn it into a book. So that's what I did. Uh, now let's talk about the book real quick. For those of you who want to know, we'll just go over it um, right here. The cost is $24.99 USD. Um, that cost will not be coming down uh, nor going up. Um, but if this is out of your price range, that's fine. Look, I have a whole trading psychology playlist on this channel. And I would say probably... 85, 90% of what's in the book is taken directly from those videos. So pretty much all this information is free. It's just in book form now for those of you who want to read it. Also, it is only available on Kindle right now. Um, 
As far as a paperback goes, do not expect that anytime soon. Um, I had heard that if you go through Amazon on the paperback route, um, it comes out a bit flimsy and low quality. And I don't know if I want my paperback to be represented that way or not. I just don't know. Um, but I'm not going to be focusing on this anytime soon. I wanted to get this project done and get it up on Kindle. It's there now. Um, so if you want to read the book um, now or anytime, really in the rest of 2020, uh, Kindle's going to be your only option, uh, which also means there's going to be no audiobook. Um, I didn't even think about this one. This was an easy choice. I wanted this whole project to be uh, an actual book, you know, a book you read and process the information that way. Um, you know, if you want an audio version of it, again, you go to the trading psychology playlist and there it is. I, you know, I don't need to replicate that. Um, so no audio book at all. Um, and it's also like when you upload it on Amazon, uh, there are other Amazons all over the world and it goes there too. Um, just so you know, I might be getting this question. Oh, is it available in Amazon India? Yes, it is. Uh, Brazil, Netherlands, UK, all over the place. And uh, when you put a book on Kindle, it really doesn't tell you how long the book is. Um, so what I can say is if it was in paperback form, it would probably be less than 200 pages. Um, so it's going to be a nice quick read. You can knock it out in a couple days. Um, I say under 200 because I think the rule of thumb is if you have 50,000 words, that's right about 200 pages. And my book, last I looked, was right about like 45,000, 46,000 words. Um, so just figure it that way. Either way, it's really quick. It's very much different than most psychology books you're going to find. That was the whole idea. Psychology books are generally very boring and not very helpful. I wanted this book to be the absolute opposite of that. So I'm going to have a link down below in the description. You can just click and go right to it if you want to go check it out. Or you can just type in No Nonsense Forex into Amazon. It should pop right up. It did for me. And I used a hidden browser just to see. Um, so either way, take a look. You can actually, they have a feature too where you can look inside. And actually you can read all of the introductory chapters and a good portion of chapter one, uh, which is pretty cool. So you can preview the book and then see if my dickish, heavy-handed writing style is right for you, or if it's not. Um, but either way, thank you to everybody for those who plan on purchasing the book. And even for those of you who don't, thanks for your patronage. Um, videos will be coming back now that I am off of my hiatus and this book is finished. So stay tuned for that. Keep on grinding, keep on building, and I will see you soon, traders. Go get it.